A beautiful Friday afternoon in May would usually be the perfect time to grab a drink on a patio, but of course that isn't possible because of COVID-19. Well, one Leslieville restaurant is making sure their patio space isn't sitting empty and they've come up with a unique partnership with another industry that's also struggling during this pandemic. To be honest, it's amazing to be back and interacting with people at a safe distance. Barrio restaurant is back in business, but it's not business as usual. This was Barrio's patio, which on a day like today would be just full of people drinking margaritas. After being closed for two months, the Queen East restaurant is making sure their patio won't sit empty this summer, now serving up drinks and tacos outside. But this time they're doing it with a little help. As I was considering something to do on this patio that was unique, Harrison and Sam approached me. Their business has been closed down as well. They're concession people, people that are doing fairs like the Stampede or the big one here in Toronto. We got together. We came here and we decided we were going to try to do something unique. Barrio has teamed up with Concessions Inc, a company that spent the last 10 years providing concession stands for state fairs and events across North America. When the news broke that all the fairs would be canceled, first it started with June, we had some hope, July, maybe we'd get August. Once it came to August, we realized that we had no income for the year. Less than two weeks ago, the two companies came up with the idea to turn Barrio's outdoor patio into a pop-up market, selling the summer favorites normally found at local fairs like the CNE, which has officially been cancelled this year. To be able to rehire some of my staff and get them back to work and get them doing something and contributing to something that's positive, something that's exciting, the reaction from our regulars and the reaction from the community has been very positive. It's given us energy to do more. So we're very happy to be here and be doing this. Of course, El Mercado is not your usual pop-up. With safety top of mind, they're taking extra precautions to stay physically distant. You either bring a mask or you're given a mask. You move one direction through the market and you take whatever you would like from the different food stalls. You pay once on the way out via credit card. A limited number of customers are allowed in at a time and all items are taken to go, including alcoholic drinks. Look at this, it comes in a pineapple. Kutso Giannopoulos says he's thrilled to finally have work for his staff and he's missed getting to interact with customers. Just being out and doing something positive for the community has made me feel really good. As for area residents, they're just happy to finally get a little taste of summer. It's good to see everybody getting together or, you know, some sense of normalcy. Barrio tells me they plan to have this pop-up social distancing market open for the next two weeks. They're waiting to hear if the restrictions will be lifted and if they'll be able to open up their patio as well. On Queen Street East, Janella Massa, City News.